The Lunch with Doug podcast is produced by the Music Exerbia Project, and today's show is brought to you in part by the Second Edition Shop at 500 East Cherry Street in Nevada, Missouri. The Bell's Boutique, also at 500 East Cherry Street in Nevada, Missouri. The Harry Frog Graphics at 150 North Commercial Street, or call them at 417-381-1077, harryfroggraphics.com. Nevada Tobacco Store at 125 West Cherry Street in Nevada, Missouri, now selling alcohol. Bobby Ogle, the doTERRA wellness advocate, essentially fit, and the interior motives, all located at 119 North Main Street in Nevada, Missouri, or visit her website at mydoterra.com forward slash Bobby Ogle. The Brickwall Bistro Catering, 417-684-1095. Verco Apparel, located at 112 North Cedar Street on the square in fantastic Nevada, Missouri. And the Casa Azteca Mexican Restaurant, located at 903 East Subway Boulevard on the historic Jefferson Highway. I'm your host, Dangerous Doug Harper. Thank you for spending your lunchtime with me. Dangerous Doug Harper back with you on Lunch with Doug. Thank you for spending your lunchtime with me. Today's episode is a bunch of rattling. I'm going to talk very crazy all over the spectrum real fast because this is just a, it's that midweek episode where everybody's like, what's going on? And we've been listening. And this is, this is an overview of what was happening and what's coming up, folks. So this weekend, if you're listening to this episode on time, you're listening to this on Wednesday, this Saturday, folks. Let me uh, let me let me see if I can fix that. Uh, this is more important than that. This, this Saturday. Saturday. There, did that get your attention? It's this Saturday. Um, it is. <laughs> um, this Saturday. This, this Saturday. Saturday is the Jefferson Fifty Four. Historic Crossroads concert. What does that mean, folks? What does that mean? It means that on the Harry Frog Graphics parking lot in Nevada, Missouri, at 150 North Commercial Street, or if you wanted to look at, if you're going down Walnut, it's the 800 block of Walnut, basically. Um, we're going to have a concert. An expo starting at 4 p.m. That's going to have a, a coffee truck there and... That's Hank's, Just Hank's coffee truck will be there. And it's going to be a lot of fun. There's going to be some uh, crafters there. There's going to be uh, the magazine, the local air magazine is going to be there. Um, I'll be there. Dangerous Doug Harper, in the flesh. I will be there and uh, I'll have post-it notes. I don't know why I said that, but I have post-it notes with me. Um, man, folks, quite frankly, I'm a little delirious because I have been working my tail off getting this thing together. And it, it is small town Nevada, so, you know, not a lot of funding for these kind of things. And I'm still waiting on some ticket purchases. Um, not a lot of uh, tickets have sold. So we did reduce that price to make it more affordable for the, for the community. But this big announcement, folks, if you show up that day, um, again... It is sort of confusing, I realize that. It's a ticketed event. Children 12 and under are free. Okay? Adults to the concert. The expo's free earlier in the day. Just the concert portion that starts at 5 o'clock. Actually, the music is at 6. So 6 to 9 is essentially a ticketed event. But if you're there, and you can be over there listening and not have a ticket. So it's, it's, it's so funny like that. It's Nevada. It's so low-key. It's not like... There's a big bunch of gates up Fort Knox or anything like that. So what we've decided is tickets that day of the show because the pre-sale tickets you got to go through the uh, through a website and there's probably a, a fee with that included. I'm not even sure what the costs on the website, um, but it would probably cost a little more. Five dollars is all we're asking, so we're just going for a suggested donation of five bucks. If you want to donate to the cause. Help us pay for the band because we have a fantastic band. Lilac Cruz is coming there. Just bring a five dollar bill, throw it in our little donation bucket, and we're gonna have fun and we're gonna do this again. But the whole idea is we're raising awareness for um, the historic highway, Jefferson Highway, which came through Nevada. We've been talking tons about that. If you want to listen to more about that, please listen to the other two episodes, Jefferson Highway, that we talk a lot about that. But this event is important, folks, because we want you there. Because we want to. What we want to do is make this into a 
a sanctioned rally through the Jefferson Highway Association. If we can get a lot of enthusiasm and some bodies on the parking lot, we'll do this again next year as a sanctioned event and utilize the um, utilize the Jefferson Highway um, resources to try to generate some more people to come to town and from all over. Um, not that there aren't some people coming to town from all over, because I know there's a few people coming in. Um, it will be a great event, but we really want to make it, we want to take 200 people and take that to 2,000 people. That's where we want to go with the event. And that's what we can do if you can show some excitement this year. So grab your $5 bill, come down to 150 North uh, Commercial Street to the Harry Frog Graphics parking lot at 4 p.m. this Saturday, July 29th, and enjoy this event. Okay, that is the event in a nutshell, the awareness event. Now, what is going on around the event has gotten really crazy. There is a lot going on in Nevada that day. Some of it is inspired by the event. Some of it is just stuff that's going on anyway, probably. Um, there's just an air of excitement in the air. So I want to tell you, uh, I want to read you this thing, and then I'll get out of here, okay? Because I don't want to go too long. I know you're on lunch, and you're going to have to take a break here eventually. So, here we go. Let's see... Well, we got we got to read this for you. All right, folks. Here is the here's the complete, brief complete and brief overview. All right, the awareness concert and shopping day. Okay, there's a shopping day also, in Nevada, Missouri, for the Jefferson Highway, uh, has a hopeful outcome of this to gain excitement and awareness of what Jefferson Highway was and is and how the town is connected to it historically to bring attention to the history and historical society and the museum locally here in Nevada, Missouri, and to have fun town building event, promote our community with shopping, music, and food, and again, hope that we can make this into an annual sanctioned event, okay, with that excitement. So that's what we're trying to achieve with this, and we're really honestly, folks, we've already achieved what we're trying to do. Now we just need bodies on the parking lot and photos. Um... To, to be exciting and, and to listen to some freaking uh, Lilac Cruise. And if you're on the neighborhood, in the lot, you'll be able to see, uh, maybe subscribe to the local ear magazine and see what that's about, too. We're going to be talking a lot about Jefferson Highway music and everything with that, too. It's kind of cool if you haven't experienced that yet. So that's there. Okay, so 8 a.m., we are going to meet 8 to 10 a.m. for coffee and biscuit and gravy breakfast. They're having a special deal there at the Precision Coffee Company. If you tell them you're Part of the Jefferson Highway event. They'll give you a little discount there when you're ordering it. Okay, the coffee company. 224 East Walnut. Located across the street from the tourist camp site, which is one of the big points of interest for this thing, is where the tourists uh, or the drivers, people traveling on the Jefferson Highway, would camp back in the day. So um, that is just across the street from Precision Coffee, so people are going to come to see that anyway. you got to get a picture with the building that's still standing there. Anyway, come to Precision Coffee, and uh, hopefully we can get a bunch of us out there and have a group photo. That would be fun. So do that. Ten, uh, 8 to 10 a.m. in the morning, Precision Coffee. They're fantastic. You know you love them. They're at 224 East Walnut, and then, of course, you actually, that's where their parking lot is, and then you go in the back, back entrance uh, to get in there if you haven't been there before. But it is an amazing place and yummy stuff. So be there or be square. Bushwhacker Museum will open at their regular opening hours on Saturday, but then they're going to be opening extended hours till 4 p.m., okay? And this is great. Um, there's also going to be a... I'm going to link our little um, Jefferson Highway, Nevada, Missouri map so you can see where the highway used to go, the different routes, and all the people that are doing stuff. And that will be linked in the description of this podcast. Lunch. Okay, so we that's going on. Then shopping day, of course, is going on all over. And self-driving tour. That's what the map's all about. That's 10 a.m. till 4 p.m. Look for signs in the winding for windows for participating locations and on and off the route and on that link. Okay? Um, yeah. What else? Lunch. We're going to have lunch at the White Grill, 200 North Commercial Street. A uh, fantastic historical restaurant with amazing burgers. Um and very, very talked about. If there's right now, lots of things are being talked about in Nevada, but the White Grill continues to get more and more press in all the great little area magazines about food and and tourism and whatnot. So go there; it's it's awesome. Very cool place. 
From 4 to 7, free expo at the Harry Frog Graphics 150 North Commercial. Just Hanks Coffee Truck will be there. Tea and Truck on site. We'll have some tables out there. Like I said, there's some crafts and stuff and vendors and awareness stuff for the highway. Um, these little, uh, we'll have some little brochure things there for you. Um, you can mill around, hang out, and we'll probably have some uh, some some tunes on the, the can music on the speaker or maybe somebody will be playing or something that's all to be announced just they'll be there unexpected we're not going to know it's going to be ex exciting the uh the scheduled music doesn't start till six with lucas connor and then the lilac cruise at 7 30 again that's part of the ticketed event but early in the day we want you to get there so so you'll still hang out okay it's going to be great uh, dinner is going to be at Casa Azteca, 7 to 10. Dinner music is going to be over there with Brooke Austin, so she'll be kind of simulcasting over there. Um, of course, you can go a little earlier if you don't want to. In between there, you can go, you know, also down to Casa. And, of course, Casa is open for lunch as well. Um, we just thought it would be fun to promote breakfast at Precision, lunch at White Grill, and dinner at Casa. That's my plan anyway. But, uh, but of course, they're open all day, so you can go to any of these places. Precision has lunch as well, too. So whatever you're feeling, in whatever order, and, of course, White Girl has breakfast. So whatever order you want to do this in. Or if you just want to eat them all at the same time, just go get takeout at each one of them and then sit in your car and eat all three of them. That's cool, too. I mean, I might, actually, I might do that, too. Uh, <laughs> so Casa Azteca, 903 East Subway Boulevard, Nevada, Missouri. Lilac Cruise, again, will be on the parking lot of Herrick Frog Graphics at 7.30 p.m. 7.30 to 8 p.m. And then 9 p.m., uh, the after party happens at Casa Azteca. Brooke Austin will still be playing. And then Aubrey and Doug, I am Doug, we will be playing at 10 o'clock till midnight or later. So it's going to be a fun night, a fun day in Nevada, Missouri. Other things I can tell you that are going on, I know in town, is there's a salsa festival at the Farmer's Market from 9 to 1 a.m. on the, the fairgrounds on Centennial Boulevard. And then there's also some music, I believe, at Sharky's at 8 p.m., and uh, going on, but check out their Facebook because I don't know the full details on that. But Sharky's is having something going on that weekend, so check out Sharky's Facebook. Check out all their Facebooks for sure. That's what I know, and yeah, I'm pretty excited. Pretty darn excited. That's what I have to say about this whole thing. So yeah, I'm out. Lunch with Doug out. Thanks for listening to me, spending your lunch time with me. See you Saturday. The Lunch with Doug podcast was produced by the Music Exerbia Project. Today's episode brought to you in part by the Second Edition Shop and the Bell's Boutique at 500 East Cherry Street in Nevada, Missouri. They hear refrog graphics at 150 North Commercial Street and 417-381-1077, Nevada, Missouri. The Nevada Tobacco Store, 125 West Cherry Street in Nevada, Missouri. Bobby Ogle, doTERRA Wellness, Essentially Fit, and interior motive is all located at 119 North Main Street in Nevada, Missouri. The Brick Wall Bistro Catering, 417-684-1095. The Burko Apparel, 112 North Cedar Street on the Square in Nevada, Missouri. And the Casa Azteca Mexican Restaurant located at 903 East Subway Boulevard, the historic Jefferson Highway in Nevada, Missouri. 